I am Anil Kumar sharing with you test questions on probability and I hope they help you to practice for your own test. The question here is, a card is drawn from a deck of 52 playing cards. We have two related questions. The first one is, what is the probability it is a 7 given that it is not a face card, right? So we are given that it is not a face card. The second one is, what is the probability it is 7 given that it is a red card? So this time we are given it is a red card. Earlier, not a face card, right? So you can pause the video, answer the question. Now, whenever we talk about conditional probability, what is important to understand? It is important to understand that these conditions, they actually change the, the total outcomes or you can say sample space. So we have to look into the new sample space to find the probability of it. So always uh, new sample space that is changed, modified, you could say. So to answer these questions correctly, you have to look into the modified sample space and then answer the question. That will help you to get the correct answer. Let's apply this knowledge and answer these questions. So the first one is, what is the probability it is a 7 given that it is not a face card? So when we say not a face card, so not a face card, it means what? Now there are 12 face cards, right? So out of 52, we have to take away the face cards which are king. So face cards are jack, queen and king or king, queen, jack. And all are of four types, right? So three times times four, four suits, so 12. So we have to take away these 12 cards. So you are working with a domain of 40 cards. Do you understand? So in our sample space, we have 40 cards only. Out of these 40 cards, how many are sevens? So number of sevens, let's say that is a event A, is four, one of each kind. Is it okay? And therefore, the probability here will be ratio of four and 40, correct? So in this particular case, we can easily write probability of this event A is 4 over 40 or 1 over 10. Okay, So that is how you can explain and write down the answer. I'd like you to apply the same strategy here and answer the next question. Now in the next question, what is the probability it is 7 given that it is a red card? So how many red cards are there? So as far as the red cards are concerned, half of them are red cards. You could also say 52 take away 26, which are black cards. So 26 are red cards, right? A number of sevens are four. So we can say here in this particular case uh, that the event B, B let this, let's call this as event B. So, so probable cases for B is four. There are four sevens. This means four sevens, right? And uh, the sample space in this case is 26. Therefore, the probability for the event B will be, I mean, 26, right? 4 over 26, which could be simplified as 2 over 13. So that is the answer for the second one, right? So it is important to understand how in conditional probability, the sample space changes, right? So that is very important to understand to answer these questions. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.